You guys, we need to stay prepared because potentially Jordans might be increasing in price once again. Yeah, he got kicks. I like swish. I don't miss. Don't do bricks. He got kicks. The kid is sick. Team with raw rock because he got hits. He got kicks. What is up, YouTube? I'm He Got Kicks. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, ring that bell that we get all the notifications every time I drop one of these bangers for you guys. Hit the like button, hit the share button, do all those great things for me. Follow me on Instagram at the real He Got Kicks, and of course the hat page Perfect Brims and TikTok He Got Kicks 95. You guys stay tuned, man. I'm going, you know, back home for a little bit, so stay tuned for the giveaway announcement. Right now, I'm shooting for Saturday, so stay tuned for, of course, on Saturday whenever I drop the video. We'll be announcing it in the video on Saturday, so stay tuned for that, man. Cannot wait. Again, man, I love being able to give back. Once we hit 45,000, I'll be giving away another pair of Lost and Founds, but super excited to give someone a pair of Lost and Founds for free, which is just crazy. But again, you guys, man, if you guys are not, you know, subscribed to the channel or anything, man, right now about 66% of people that watch me are not subscribed. Hey, hit that subscribe button. Takes two seconds. It's free. And we get to hit these milestones a lot quicker and be able to give away more shoes. So again, man, stay tuned, man. I cannot wait. But you guys, today's video, man, we are going over something that I saw that usually is what starts the process of Jordans going up once again is whenever the Jordan 11 increases in price. This year, the DMP Air Jordan 11, saw from Soul Retriever, is going up to $230 retail, which is just absolutely insane. Because $230 for me, with a 10% sales tax, is just kind of ridiculous, honestly, is $253 after tax even. So $253 is how much that a Air Jordan 11 DMP this year is going to cost me if I can hit for retail. And we all know that that's going to be hard to do because everybody and their mother are going to be going after it on December 9th. So what I've noticed whenever like it comes to like prices increasing and stuff like that, honestly, that is usually what starts it is whenever the Air Jordan 11 increases in price and you can kind of expect right behind it, the Jordan is going to increase just by a little bit, whether it's, you know, Jordan 1 lows or, you know, Jordan 1 mids, highs, or if you get to like the where we're at now, $210 for basically almost every Jordan is basically $210, $200. So I think that this might be the time that they might actually be going up again because we've seen it steadily increasing over the last couple of years it has just been increasing and increasing and you know again i mean there's not much we can i guess do about it i guess other than not buy it but we all know we're not going to do that so we just kind of are stuck with it and it is what it is but i definitely can expect probably something's going to go up here soon I don't know what it's going to be. I don't know if it's going to be all Jordans. I doubt it will be every single Jordan, but it very possibly could be. So I'm kind of waiting to see exactly what's going to happen and what's going to increase because something's going to. You guys already know this is always what triggers it. The moment that they see something sells at this price, they're like, okay, well, if they're buying this at this price, they'll buy the other stuff at this price because we're still buying sneakers at $210, $200. Like, they're still, you know, selling out. So, I would expect something to increase. Maybe Jordan 1 highs will go to $190 uh, before tax, which, which would be crazy because I still remember them being $160 less than, like, four years ago. So, I don't know. It's kind of crazy that I kind of think that um, I'm not really... Or expect the best, prepare for the worst, you know, that's that, if that's how the saying goes. But that is definitely something that I'm kind of looking at and watching now because, again, every time that this has happened, the Air Jordan 11 has increased in price by some amount, whether it's $5, $10, whatever it may be. But, again, you know, I remember Jordan 11s have always really been 220 but now they're starting to creep and creep and creep. And now 230, 253 after tax, that's, that's just crazy to me because 250 retail for a sneaker, like that is just crazy to me. So like I said, man, expect that, you know, the unexpected, I guess, or, you know, prepare for the worst. I just definitely can see it happening and I don't want it to because again, 
it is super expensive and you guys know I buy everything early anyways but that's for you guys you know if I want something for retail I still want to be able to get it at a reasonable retail price and again if they just keep increasing and increasing and increasing every single year it's it's gonna be tough so you know, I remember somebody told me one time that $300 was a lot for a sneaker well we're creeping up there like it's getting up there like now that it's in the 250 range for a Jordan 11 now that it's over 250 for a Jordan 11 it's definitely up there now if you ask me if I ever think a Jordan will be $300 retail like a regular GR not no collab nothing like that my answer would probably be no but I don't think that'll ever happen but there might be special circumstances like you know the J Balvin's but that was a collab and now they're going for way less than retail but like if you look all the way back and it was kind of crazy somebody posted this the other day I think it was still Soul Retriever and how $230 is the retail price of the Jordan 11 DMP this year when the Jordan 6 and 11 DMP pack released in 2006 granted 17 years ago and price everything changes price changes over time everything but now there's only a $65 difference between the Air Jordan 11 DMP this year and the entire pack of 2006 they released for $295 so again prices everything changes over time everybody knows that everybody knows that the prices weren't going to stay the same as you know everything increases you know it's harder to get you know the containers and it's you know doubled the expense to get the containers to ship them over here you know if everything goes up for them the retail price goes up for us and that's just how it is so i've come to grips with that working in retail especially sneaker retail for basically my entire adult life until now I know like that's how it goes it's how it always will be but it's it's definitely something that we need to pay attention to and really really just kind of wait and see what's gonna happen and then we decide from there what we're gonna do because I'm telling you guys this is where it usually starts once that Jordan 11 goes up and it sells and of course it's going to sell out that's whenever we can expect potentially another increase in price so everybody's kind of pay attention you know let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below because again man i want this channel to be a discussion board basically where everybody put your thoughts and everything you think about what's going on in the comment section and again you may be like oh well, he got kicks it's crazy you know he's stupid whatever hey it you know hey i might be but i've been right a lot and so let's just kind of pay attention let's see where we go from here and hopefully we just don't see a you know a regular gr sneaker you know be at 250 eventually that would suck because 250 and then your sales tax and everything on it you are pushing that 300 dollars. so let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about the topic of the day i love you guys thank you guys for everything and again man i cannot wait to give back to you guys and to continue to give back every five thousand guys what you guys have done for me i cannot thank you guys enough but this is small small tokens of my gratitude i feel like so i appreciate it so so much thank you guys for everything and again if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button ring that bell love you guys see you guys in the next video peace